Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel, I'm Bill. We're in the uh, Advanced Player's Guide today. We're continuing the archetype, archetype class build today. We're on the Barbarian class. The archetype we're looking at for the Barbarian class today is the Invulnerable Rager. So without further ado, let's read into what you would get as an Invulnerable Rager and what you would lose from the regular Barbarian class. Uh, some barbarians learn to take whatever comes their way, sh shrugging off mortal wounds with ease. These barbarians invite their enemies to attack them and use pain to fuel their rage. An invulnerable rager has the following class features. Invulnerability. At second level, the invulnerable rager gains dr slash dash equal to half the barbarian level. This damage reduction is doubled against non-lethal damage. This ability replaces Uncanny Dodge, Improved Uncanny Dodge, and Damage Reduction. Extreme Endurance at 3rd level. The Invulnerable Rager is inured to either hot or cold climate effects. Choose one, as if using Endure Elements. In addition, the Barbarian gains 1 point of Fire or Cold Resistance for every 3 uh, levels beyond 3rd. This ability replaces Trap Sense. Rage Powers. The following Rage Powers complement the Invulnerable Rager Archetype. Come and Get Me, Guarded Life, Increased Damage Reduction, Inspire Ferocity, Reckless Abandon, and Renewed Vigor. I could really see me playing an Invulnerable Rager. That would be a great uh, archetype to play as a Barbarian, at least in the style of Barbarian I love to play up there in melee doing all that stuff. The downside is, is you lose some of your like trap sense, your ability to avoid getting flanked and, and such because the uncanny dodges go away. But your damage reduction does make up for it because so at fourth level you have a damage reduction two, sixth level three, so on and so forth. And then if you take improved damage reduction that increases it even further, so, or increased damage reduction as one of the rage powers. But there's also feats from 3rd edition where you could increase your damage reduction, so you could take those too. I can see that being very useful. If you all have seen an Invulnerable Rager played in your games, or you've played one, or created one, uh, let me know in the comments below. Until we all game again, guys.